After an 18-day ordeal that riveted people around the world, Thai Navy SEALs said on Tuesday that all 12 boys and their soccer coach were rescued from a flooded cave in northern Thailand. The work we have achieved here, I think it is partly because we have power, the power of love, the power to love each other. Everyone sent it to the boys and their coach, encouraging all officers to be able to work. Eight of the boys had been brought out of the cave by a team of Thai and international divers on Sunday and Monday, and the remaining four and their coach were brought out safely on Tuesday. <laughs> Volunteers at the temporary medical center on site expressed their jubilation. The plight of the boys had captivated Thailand and much of the world. From the news they were originally missing to the first video of the huddle of anxious boys when they were found 10 days later by a pair of British divers. How many of you? The boys and their coach were trapped in the cave on June 23rd when they went exploring after soccer practice and it became flooded by monsoon rains. Conditions inside the cave were treacherous, and none of the boys had diving experience. One Thai Navy SEAL died on Friday while partaking in rescue operations. <laughs> Despite the obstacles, a health official said the members of the Wild Boris team remained in good spirits. They are now being treated at a nearby hospital. The first group of patients, there are four aged 14 to 16. Preliminarily, they had low body temperatures, so we're taking care of them with body heating equipment. Additionally, we found that two have irregular x-ray results in their lungs, and we suspect that it could be lung infections. It could be at least seven days before the boys can be released from the hospital. But the public is eager to see and hear from the young team once they've recovered. Noreen Nasser, The Associated Press.